A recent Google report finds Gen Z doesn't really read articles. They trust influencers and online comments to tell them everything they wanted. Google researched and looked at the ways that Gen Z processes information. It's too long, they don't read. They see the top of the article and they don't want to read all of that. It's a lot of work. So they'll go to the bottom of the article and see what the comments say. Or they'll find something important on the internet, but that's a lot of thing to process themselves. Instead, they'll have their friend or their influencer tell them in a video what they need to believe. I suppose it's kind of like a college literature class. Maybe you had one of those where you forgot to read the book that was assigned that day and you sit in class and you kind of look around and you, you hope that everybody else has read it. You hope that they know what they're talking about and so you chime in with the professor to make it seem like you read. Maybe you had a different college literature experience than I did. But if you forget to do the actual reading, you just hope the crowd is right. Trusting the crowd to be right might work sometimes. It might be a last ditch effort. But if you're truly crowdsourcing intelligence, then you'll get what the crowd gives. And you may not be happy that you don't have true intelligence. You just have someone else's. Psalm 115. Not unto us, O Lord, not unto us, but to your name be the glory because of your love and faithfulness. To your name be the glory. You didn't crowdfund intelligence. You didn't tell us other stuff. You give us truth. You give us bite-sized morsels like this passage, like this psalm, that doesn't take me a long time to read, but is something I can grow on and meditate. My, my biggest hope with these devotions is that you, you stop them, that you open your Bibles or open the Bible app and see the truth God has for you in it. Not, not the truth that I give to you, but that you would actually get into it yourself. I'm not here to be some influencer that you find truth from. I'm here to drive you to the only source of truth, God's word, and Jesus Christ our Savior found within.